Hi everyone, this is just an introductory video. I'm going to be asking you to introduce yourself to me in your first assignment, or at least as part of that. And since you're going to be watching a lot of my pre-recorded videos, I just wanted to introduce myself. I also hope that I get to meet you either in visiting the discussion sections or if you come to office hours, which I really hope you will. Um, so just a little bit about me. Um, you can say my, my last name is Shot, but really I'm, I would prefer it and I hope you're comfortable just calling me Sarah. Um, I'm originally from Florida, Winter Springs, which is a, a suburb of Orlando. So if anybody's from around there, that would be interesting. I'd love to hear it. I lived in Florida for 22 years. I went to college at the University of Florida and there I studied math and I also study women's studies. So I think it's really nice that Duke has this focus on a liberal, liberal arts education. Um, once I completed my bachelor's degree, I immediately went to Duke for my PhD in math. And so I came to Duke to do math research and we had to actually teach in order to get paid. And it turned out that I loved teaching, which was something I was a little bit scared to do. And in fact, I loved it a lot more than working on my math research. So um, that opened up a whole new career path for me. And I was very fortunate and excited that I could continue to teach at Duke. And in 2012, after I got my PhD, I, I switched over to the faculty role. So I've actually been teaching here since 2007, but several of those years that was as a graduate student. Um, so that's a little bit about me professionally. I've taught Calculus II a number of times. It's probably my favorite course to teach. Um, just a little bit more about me maybe personally. Uh, my husband also teaches in the math department here. Um, he often teaches either linear algebra or multivariable calculus in some format. He has a different last name, Fitzpatrick. And um, a big life event for, for both of us is that we recently had twins. So partly I'm telling you this because you're going to hear them crying, um, probably during videos, um, maybe office hours, and hopefully that won't be too, too distracting. Uh, we're very fortunate that he is able to take parental leave this semester. So uh, that does free up a lot of time for me, but this teaching from home is definitely gonna be a little distracting. Um, so I have a couple pictures here. Um, let's see if I can bring up. Uh, let's see, I have to share my screen. So I have, um, first let's look at baby A, who's Evelyn. Um, so that's one of the twins and I can go clunky here. And then the other twin is Sloan and I'll show you what she looks like. So I've got a lot of uh, cute baby stuff going on at my house, which is distracting, but also very fun. Um, coming back to me. So I was teaching and they were supposed to be due pretty much at the end of the spring semester. Um, but they came eight weeks early. And while that was scary, it also meant that I didn't have to deal with any of the switch to online teaching. Somebody came in and taught for me uh, while they were in the NICU for a while. Um, so consequently, this teaching online is going to be a little bit new for me. Um, it's kind of been fun trying to figure it out, but hopefully you all will work with me and, and help me make it a better experience. Um, so that pretty much wraps it up. Like I said, I really, really hope that you'll come to office hours and that I'll get to interact with you and I'm looking forward to a, a great semester.